Okay, guys, let's discuss the question which is related to the C20 curriculum and digital electronics. This is a previous question paper of uh, polytechnical students. This is the question. And coming to the C20 curriculum, the question paper model has changed, and uh, every question contains one 10 mark, 10 marks question. So now I am going to discuss the answer related to this question. So this is the truth table which is given in the question paper. And we have drawn the table here same which has given in the question paper and also now the first step is we need to form the expression in the question we have one concept that justify SOP or POS SOP means product sum of products and POS means product of sums now first of all we will know about what is SOP right so SOP means sum of products so in between the brackets we will have this sum the first term is sum always the sum will be in between brackets and what is the product the mean the term indicates that the term inside the bracket is in the form of product if we observe here a b c that means they are in the product form so now i will say that a b c C plus A bar B bar C plus and something like A bar B bar C bar I am gonna tell you how this A bar B bar C and came but this term is called sum of products that means sum of product means always there will be a plus term in between the brackets and and again now I am going to say that product of sum so if we observe here we have got some more products like if we observe this in between the brackets there will be a plus term but if we observe here i didn't keep the dot but in between the brackets there will be a product that means product of some means there will be a dot in between brackets and some means inside the term you will have a plus b plus c into a bar plus b bar plus c into a plus b plus c bar in this way we will get the product of sums so now it is clear about the product of sums and sum of products and these are the first steps why because they ask it to justify sop or pos and the next step is and i'm going to tell you how these terms had got like a bar b bar c and a bar b bar c so let's see here here the first term is 0 0 0 we know that if the 0 indicates a bar and 1 indicates a similarly 0 indicates b bar and 1 indicates b and c bar c if the term is 0 obviously we indicate with bar either it is a bar or b bar or c bar if the term is 1 the input term is 1 it indicates a or b or c here and one more thing is in the output block we had some number of ones those are 1 2 3 4 5 6 number of ones that means we have got output here and we need to consider only these six terms up to here we did we don't have any need to consider these zero terms we have to consider only up to here and we have to draw write the expression for this only i i want to tell how to write the expression for this the first term is zero 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 so simply we can write as a bar b bar and c bar right this is for sum of products this is for sum of products and for product of sums it will be a bar plus b bar plus c bar you will get a bracket fine and the second term if you observe there is a one here so we need to consider this zero zero one so first term is zero the a get bar second term zero b will get bar and third term one obviously it will be only c we don't get bar because it is 1. And here a bar plus b bar plus c. And coming to the third term, here also we have 1. 0, 1, 0. That means 
a0 that is a bar b1 that is only b and for c it is 0 we get c bar and here also a bar plus b plus c bar and this term over and the next term is 0 1 1 so obviously we can write 0 means a bar 1 1 b c a bar plus b plus c finally this term also completed how many 1 2 3 4 and remaining two terms we have that is 1 0 0 and 1 1 1 for 1 0 0 we write a b bar c bar and for 1 0 1 a b bar c and for this we need to play, keep the plus in between these terms okay if we observe here we got six terms why because we have only six output outputs but remaining two outputs are zero so we need we don't need to consider these two terms we only consider these six terms and if we observe here there will be a now we have to write this keep the brackets and plus 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 these are the terms we will get if you observe here. The first a bar b bar c. Second term a bar b bar c. First term a bar b bar c bar a bar b bar c and the third a bar b c bar and fourth a bar b c and the fifth a b bar c and the last term is a b bar c and here a b bar c bar. Similarly the product of some expression also written here this is the product of expression which have plus and there is a product in between the brackets and here also we have cleared how we got this expression from this table only we have considered only this one term so it is we doesn't have any need to consider these zeros and the next step is to form a k map we know that the form is 2 power n if it is 2 power n is equals to if the inputs are only 2 then we need to consider 2 power 2 it will be 4 then we will get only 4 blocks but here we got the input as 3 terms inputs a b c only 3 terms so we consider 2 power 3 we got 8 and now we need to add extra 2 more 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay and that is the next step we need to consider how many blocks we need to draw and we know that 8 we have got 8 blocks here and we had divided into a bar and b bar so we got 3 terms right so for two, only 2 blocks for 2 blocks that means 2 power 2 1 2 3 4 that means 2 power n equals to 2 power 2 equals to 4 you will get only 2 inputs that is a and b and here we will consider a here b so a bar a b bar b in this case we can write but coming to the three inputs we need to draw like this only the a terms will come here and remaining b and c terms will come here for zero and we draw a bar here and a here and for b and c here we have b and c so the first term is zero zero so for zero zero we have written written b bar c bar and for zero one we have written b bar c and 1 1 we have written b bar b c and for 1 0 this will be b c bar okay we have got these numbers in this form and i have represent the numbers also here along with the alphabets here also the same now the next step is we need to mention the numbers at it's already described and explained in k map like how we will get this number 0 1 2 3 and 4 5 6 7 in order to simple you have to remember these steps means you will get 0 1 2 3 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 the numbers will not come in a form and after representing these numbers and the next step is we need to mention the one terms in this block how we will mention just see here the first term is a bar b bar c bar the term is a bar b bar c bar if we observe here where is the a bar term will come this means a bar that means obviously the term will come in this block only and next 
the terms are b bar c bar we need to check b bar c bar 1 c b bar c bar if the term contains b bar means it's obviously zero and it is also zero and where the zero zero term had in this block here the first term is zero and in this block at in this situation you will get one and at the same a bar b bar c a bar means obviously this term b bar c write the b bar c here b bar means zero c means one if we observe zero and one you will get here that means you need to place the one here if in case the term is a b bar c then where we will get the number a means you will get here in this block and b bar c means it's obviously 0 and 1 you need to place the 1 here right in similarly we need to mention all these expressions that means obviously we will get 6 expressions that means not 6 expressions in one expression we will get those 6 numbers like this this is the second time which we have mentioned and already discussed and the finally you will get those six terms one two three four five six if you observe here you will get the six terms one two three four five six right so finally we have mentioned all the inputs but we didn't get the smallest expression from this k map so why we use the k map means in order to reduce the largest expression to the smallest expression and from this table we will short we will get the small expression and see how the expression will come now if we observe here this is the a bar expression so it is clear that the expression is only in a bar and it doesn't have any from this tip. we have four inputs and it will express if the only if we have only two inputs so here if we observe the, there are only six inputs and there are six ones containing here and six blocks so the four numbers are in one form and we will consider this square box as one form now it will get one expression this will get one expression we need we are adding both these terms and how these expressions will come if you observe here this is the term zero and this this will be a bar and for entire the term we will get only a bar and we don't get any b c b c bar b c or and b bar c bar why we don't get means here there are four blocks containing four different blocks so we so we no need to consider these blocks and coming to the next block plus first block you got a bar and coming to this if you observe a bar and a both are containing so we need to eliminate this block and we have to consider from this two only if you observe from this two one is b c one is b bar c bar and another term is b bar c in this the common term is b bar so obviously the term will be a bar plus b bar this is the final answer for this question and this uh, yeah if you observe the same process had done here and the next step we got a bar plus b bar so starting at the starting stage lo manam maniki ichina table a table aithe ichchado aa table ni obvious ga draw chestam justify sop or pos annadu kabatti manam sop gaani pos rendittloni danni justify cheyochu and it is possible so ikkada manam first expression ni draw chesukovali either it pos or sop and sop anna pos anna manam expression ela form chestuntam annadi already discuss chesam product of sums ante maniki products madhyalo madhyalo products unte and brackets madhyalo unde terms sums avute sum of products aithe maniki brackets madhyalo sum term untundi and madhyalo product terms unte and that manam k map ni draw cheyali ante manaku oka condition undi and maniki any inputs anni unte dani 2 power n form lo any nth number vaste dani aa terms lo manam blocks lo represent cheyali so ippudu maniki ikkada 2 power 2 unte manam 4 blocks draw chestam and 3 unte 8 blocks for one we need to draw 16 blocks draw just quality and for this question maniki three inputs e unnai kabatti manam 2 power 3 only 8 blocks maniki saripothundi and that too 
8 blocks are in the same way. So, we will draw 8 blocks. And we will draw a number of order. And we will draw a number of order. So, I am not explaining all the details. But I am not explaining all the details. But I am explaining simply. We will draw 0, 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4, 5, 6, 7. In this form, we will draw this table. We will draw the number of order. We will draw the number of order. We will draw the number of order. And we will mention the number of order. We will mention the number of order. इकड़ा अलाउ होच्छ नहीं हो ये एक्सप्रेशन ही मानों सिंपल का ये टेबल लो एक्सप्रेस चेस्टा सो ए बार बी बार सी बार ए बार अनुन्नति का बट्टी आई थे इकड़ा गानी इकड़ा गान रावल बट ए बार मानें कि स्टार्टिंग ब्लॉक लों दिखा बट्टी ऑब्वियस का नंबर मानों इकड़ा मेंशन चाहिए बट इनका मानें कि फोर ये फोर ऑप्शंस लो मनो ओके ब्लॉक लो मात्र में मेंशन चल एंड द नेक्स्ट टर्म मने की बी बार सी बार होंगे ऑलरेडी ए बार नहीं मनो ऐकर उन्हों डिसाइड दे सम एंड द रिमाइंडिंग टू टर्म्स बी बार सी बार सो ये बी बार सी बार नहीं मनो मैं कर मेंशन चल स्तामंटे आकर नंबर सेम होंटे बी बार अंडे जीरो सी बार अंड सो जीरो जीरो आने टर्म मन के इकड़ा फर्स्ट प्लेस लोने उन्हें का बटी फर्स्ट प्लेस लो वन मेंशन चल स्ताम एंड द सिमिलर वे एंड नेक्स्ट ए बार बी बार सी ए बार बी बार सी ए बार आने उन्हें का बटी ऑब्वियसली इट विल कम इन द फर्स्ट ब्लॉक ए बार इकड़ उन्हें का बटी मन के ई ब्लॉक लो मात्र में उस तुने B bar अंटे मने की 0, C अंटे 1, so 0, 1 अने term मने की next term लो निगा बटी 1 मनम इकड़ प्लेस चास्ताम, so इला नी remaining terms नी कुड़ consider चास्को नी draw चास्ताम, and one more example is here इकड़ observe चास्ते, A, B bar, C bar उन्दी, so A, B bar, C bar उन्दी अंटे इकड़ A उन्दी, A अंटे मने की M represent चास्ती, 1 represent चास्ती, 1 अंटे मने की E block लो मने की E block लो number होती नहीं but E four blocks लो वक्का block लो होती नहीं and A block नहीं मन वाला decide चाहता it should be B bar C bar मने की B bar C bar उन्हें B bar अंडे zero C bar अंडे zero 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 एक रूप दी and मन हम represent चाहते हैं इन्हें E block so one ना नहीं दिख रहा होता है so remaining E terms अन्य को ना मन अलग है होता है and final का मने की अच्छी ना term A इंडी अंडे A plus A bar plus B bar this is the final term which we get and दिन की solution ये question की solution आई थे ये दोस्त ने answer and in case of मानों product of sums का ना कतेस कुंटे ना answer will be simply a bar b bar this is for the in in two cases we have justified but I have explained only one way but we all the same table will be got the answer will be different this is the a bar b bar and we will get a a bar b bar and a bar plus b bar those are the two different answers but the process will be same for entirely but here you will get the expression small change in those signs.